guys uh, welcome back to say boy again i'm slink how you guys doing uh good morning good afternoon good evening depending on where you guys are watching this video from so you guys recall that uh police officer uh, last year that shot and killed a pregnant lawyer in the presence of a husband well yesterday the guy was sentenced and he was sentenced to of course hang my god god well will this send a very strong message to the nigeria police that they shouldn't be going around uh, intimidating citizens civilians should be going around intimidating civilians this is not the first time we have seen such judgment but yet some of our zealous police officers are still going about doing the same thing mm -hmm. intimidating sorry intimidating making life unbearable for for many 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 persons out there well we got exactly what it deserved i do not feel a single pity for him honestly speaking of i do not feel a single pity for him the only person i'm pitying is that pregnant woman a woman equally heavily pregnant ah you open fire for him and you see me they pity you well, justice has been served, and uh, of course, I hope it's carried out. Then let's talk about scales. Scales is currently crying after he was mercilessly beaten by EFCC yesterday night. Scales posted a picture showing his leg brutally eat, and uh, I think one of the bones is broken. According to what he posted, he said, "So EFCC pull up to my house." With theory men with gun and some with sticks and armors. L O L. They broke my back door while I was sleeping on the bed with my six month old daughter. Imagine if I had panic attack because of my health issues. Is this not a crime? God go punish you now, EFCC. I am not a criminal. I have never done fraud in my life. You came in with guns to oppress me in front of my daughter and her mother and my staffs. You will never, you will never prosper in anything you do as long as you, your, you are EFCC staff. You will always be a failure. He said you will never prosper in anything you do as long as you are EFCC staff. You will always be a failure. I think there are process to this. You can easily invite here, invite skills to come to the EFCC to 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 come for questioning or or come there with a, a warrant of arrest. Why must you always come to people house at night like criminals? You guys are EFCC. You have the authority to walk into someone's house house during daytime and act proper like an officer. Why, why, why are you people like this? Why people like say, ah, this EFC said that human beings like us. The Nigerians also face the economy hardship. One point they face the oppression as well before getting employed here into EFCC. Why are they acting like people who were not part of Nigerians, who were who who they throw come, you know, who they throw come from uh, from from here, from uh, the skies down to Nigeria? It makes me, it baffles me. You know the process of Nigeria, you know what is happening in Nigeria, yet you still add to the problem of Nigeria. Ah, there are processes to this thing. And yet you want to tarnish the image of EFCC. Your officer going in the middle of the night. When there are process, invitation, then you go there during the daytime. Why must you go there at the night? Well, according to our skills, Someone said, sue them. Then he said, sue them in Nigeria. They are all the same. I repeat, the justice system in Nigeria is lies. Who do I report to, please? They are all corrupt and the same. Then they find a uh, Uguje this night. Then someone says, skills, what's the main issue? Did they come to a, to, did, did they come for an arrest, search, or interrogation? They said, Skills said, they said they got an intel that I am into fraud. They said it's a routine check. That's all. And they found nothing. 
He said it's a routine check. Routine check to check if a case is doing fraud. A routine check to check if a case is doing fraud. A routine check. Someone that has not been indicted, someone that has not done anything. You say they do routine check, come, come, person, yeah, go check if they do fraud. Wow, this country. Eh? Shame. Okay, who, who are we going to blame? The government. Even though we blame government, are those people not human beings as well as Nigerians? Eh? We are there employed during childbirth. They pass through the process of living in Nigeria, seeing the Nigeria struggle, going to school, going to primary, secondary, and seeing the discrimination, then getting. To that stage of being employed, they get employed only to have the mindset of oppressing other people. Is the, 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 don't that baffle you? Are they computers? They are not computers, they are human beings, flesh and blood in their veins. They are brothers and sisters. They also pass through what we are passing through, and yet they want to oppress people with their position. And they will go to church, they will go mosque, go say Allah, Allah. Some will go to church, go, go, go cry to God. What is wrong with human beings? Human beings are wicked. Though. When the Bible Quran said that uh, the heart of a human is dangerously wicked. <laughs> Kai, when human beings are wicked, though, what can be more, what can be more uh, devilish than that? Knowing that you are going through the normal process of every human being in Nigeria, so every youth in Nigeria, and you, you, before you were employed, you will sit with your friends and say, Sky, police, they oppress us, Nigeria, they oppress us, only to get employed. And the only mindset is to oppress other people. No anthem of feelings, no single slight of it. We know those people that should be arrested, we know, but are they doing their? Uh, their investigation well. No. They are just doing trial law. They are just running it out there. Just arrest people. Nothing else. Where do they who do that in this world? Spoiling people's businesses. Scattering doors. And go, you will laugh with your truth. with your people. <laughs> with God. Don't worry. Your own will come for you one day. Uh -uh. Don't you understand the meaning of karma? If you don't understand the meaning of karma, now you will feel saying nothing will happen to you. He will come one day. God has given us an example, and that example is Pharaoh. You know, with Pharaoh, go and check where he's lying. He will come one day. You can do whatever you want to because you have the power. Have you? Continue. I'm just being pissed about not even for scale matter, based on other things that, that, that has been happening before, ever since. And again, you guys heard what uh, Naramali lawyer said. That Mubad lied. He said Mubad lied between Samlari and Naramali. And nothing like getting at that Samlari didn't come to that place where Zlatan and Naramali, Zlatan and the Mubad were, were shooting in a music video. That Samlari didn't come to that place to oppress anybody. That Sam Larry was around the beach. Then they told Sam Larry that Mubad, that somebody was shooting a music video. Then he came there and saw Sam Larry. I saw me, I saw and, and I saw Mubad. So you mean say they told someone that uh, someone is shooting a music video? You came there with class to drive there, and then you now saw it because Mubad. The lawyer said Mubad lied against Sam Larry. Mubad says Sam Larry broke the, the equipment that they were using. That Mubad lied. Ah. That Mubad even ate, uh, uh, ate uh, they, they went to a restaurant to eat after the incident. Ah. Then after the incident, uh, and after eating a restaurant, Mubad then went. Mubad then went to the police to submit. Petition against Sam Larry. See, uh, in all this, all this, uh, I'm just waiting. My court, the court case that Ms. Latan said, then they no come outside. Now, they will know all those Latan, they are among the fake friends.
nobody yet. I'm just saying my peace of mind then. I'm just saying my peace of mind. Just saying my peace of mind. Some Larry lawyer said no bad light. Light. Kai, all those quack lawyers, eh? Well, who no fear lawyers, eh? <laughs> I fear that person. Person me no fear lawyer, I fear that person. I even doubt if many lawyers could make it one. Kai. Ah, who no fear lawyer? Who no fear lawyer? Who no fear lawyer? Even lawyer they fear themselves. Talk more of you as a civilian. Ordinary person may no read law, no call the fear lawyer. I will tell you things, eh? Well, it's crazy though. Let's see what we have.